morning. How y'all doing? <clears throat> How y'all doing? I want to talk about those two college basketball, the men's and the women's. Uh, congratulations to South Carolina and Dawn Staley. She's done an incredible job. You know, the black woman, she catches a lot of flack for this or that. Some people hating about the anthem thing, tripping, but they spank UConn's behind. Uh, Gino, arguably the greatest uh, college basketball coach, especially on the uh, you know, women's basketball. Well, maybe men, Gino, um, can't even last name right now. But anyway, they beat UConn. And when you beat UConn women's basketball, that's like beating the cream, cream of the cream. You know, just beating them up, and they beat them up, and that was very impressive by South uh, Southern South Carolina Gamecocks. I mean, they were balling, and um, you just don't beat UConn like that. They were eleven no going in, so that was a very impressive. And I tip my cap to Coach Staley and what they what she did incredible. Had them prepared. They was on defense. They guarded. They was balling. They did the smash. On the men's side, <clears throat> now last night, like some halftime, it looked like Carolina was going to smash and blow Kansas off the, you know, like Hubert Davis, like Bill Self, like Kansas was just happy to be there. But the second half, they came out with the f- uh, full court press. They pressed them. They turned a 16 point deficit and came back the largest deficit ever in college basketball. I didn't think Carolina was a chip word. This is, see, this is why. When I did an earlier video about the 64, why I say, especially on the men's side, the women's side is more intriguing because you have a UConn, you have teams that are going to be there. The men's side ain't the same because we don't always get the best players because guys, i.e. draft, i.e. overseas, are one and done. So there are things that, you know, you would have never seen this, I don't think, on a Dean Smith team to blow a lead like that. But that press that Candace put on, Bill Self, they made adjustments. And they did the thing, and they wanted it, and they won, and they won by three. So that was impressive. So I just wanted to give uh, South Carolina and Kansas, the women's and the men's uh, NCAA champs, their due. They both prevailed in big ways. But tell me what you thought about the women's and the men's tournament. Did you like one or the other, what have you? They both were compelling different reasons because South Carolina, they smashed UConn. It wasn't even up for no discussion. That game last night. And you thought Carolina was going to just run away and they got caught and, and did they get caught. So let me know what you think. Please like, subscribe with thoughts, comments, and I do respond. Thank you. Wash your hands. Keep your mind closed. Watch out for another. And uh, those finals were good, you know, you know, but, you know, like I said, the men's game ain't the way it used to be, you know, for different reasons. And I'm out.